Almost 19 years after the launch of the PDs, tomorrow sees the launch of what we've been promised will be this decade's radically different political party. While the name of this new enterprise is being kept under wraps until the party's constitution is lodged with the clerk of the Dáil tomorrow, tonight we can reveal some details. Of the seven former Fine Gael TDs and senators who were members of the Reform Alliance, four will run in the next election for the new party. Party leader Lucinda Crichton has named Wicklow TD Billy Timmons as her deputy leader. Dublin North East TD Terence Flanagan and Cork Senator Paul Bradford are also on board. The party will have seven regional leaders who will select small committees to build constituency organisations. Each region will have its own fundraiser. Of the 3,000 who have signed up to the Reboot Ireland site, 700 have expressed an interest in being a candidate, according to party sources. Over 140 people have already completed an online questionnaire in a bid to become a party candidate. There will be no selection conventions. All prospective candidates will be interviewed by the National Board of the Party and ratified through an online vote of the entire party membership. We're told the new party will be economically conservative and socially radical. And I'm now joined by the deputy leader of this new party, Billy Timmons. Billy Timmons, I've been looking you around Leinster House for a long time. I think you've been in there something like 18 years. You are dyed in the wool Fine Gael. You are uh, part of a Fine Gael political dynasty. Aren't you going to have difficulty getting people to take you seriously as the face of this new radical departure? Well, that's a very legitimate uh, point, Katie, and I can understand it. And it's one that our detractors have and will make. What I'd say to you is that, yes, there will be some old blood, but political commentators and the public have been crying out for new blood. Uh, we were unique in Fine Gael that we stood by our beliefs. We were expelled from the party as a result of it. We have soldiered alone for almost two years now, and certainly politically it has been very educational for me. And I believe that we will bring forward new blood in the next few days. And I trust... And who, in, who is it? Give us a sense. Who, where is this new blood? You are going, who, who to, you going, going to see You are going to see tomorrow. I've listened to commentators saying, will they have former cabinet ministers? And I ask you, do we want someone that sat at cabinet during the collect, co collapse of the can, economy? Do we want someone that sat at cabinet during the creation of Irish water? We will bring forward people from civic society, very, very capable people. And I have every confidence that the Irish people will look at what's on offer. We are going to offer something transformative. We are going to offer something for renewal with the main purpose of improving the quality of life for the citizen. And yes, we will have detractors. And the reason we'll have detractors is because we will grow in the months ahead. But haven't we seen this before? I mentioned the PJs there in the, intro, in the introduction. You know, they were, they were here, they're gone. The electorate didn't want them anymore. Yeah, we are not the PDs recreated. PDs had a very successful innings during government for, what, 15 or 16 years and a big impact on policy. I would like to think if we can look back in 10 or 15 years and have the same impact on policy, albeit for different reasons, that I would be very satisfied. And I have every confidence that we will have that impact. But is it not true that if you hadn't had that difficulty with Fine Gael, you would still be in the party. If it wasn't for the Protection of Life and Pregnancy Bill, you would still be there. Well, that's something we'll never know, and I don't really have an interest in looking back. I want to look forward. We are where we are, and tomorrow we will launch a new offering to the Irish people. OK, that's it. That's all we have time for tonight, Billy Timmons. Uh, uh, the next... Over to Miriam now.